Hey, it's Delaney. I've done this like 20 times, so I'm just gonna tell you. Here's how I did my eyeshadow today. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm going to be starting out by using this headband and putting it around my hair so that my hair doesn't get in the way of my makeup. And I'm going to be using my Maybelline Master Prime Primer and just taking it in little dots and putting it all around my face. And just rubbing it in once I'm all done. Now I'm going to be taking my Sweet Peach Palette with the shade Georgia and I'm going to be using it basically as a base with this random brush. I don't even know what it's called because it doesn't have anything on it. So just use whatever brush you want. But I'm just applying that all over the lid of my eye. Then I'm going to be mixing the shades Candied Peach and Just Peachy with my Sonia Kashuk number 109 brush. And I'm going to be applying that into the crease with a back and forth motion. Now I'm going to be using the shade Delectable, which is just a darkish purple color, and I'm using my Real Techniques Defining Crease Brush and putting that in the inner corner of my eye because I feel like this is the best brush out of the options that I had to use for this. And we're putting it in the inner corner in the outer corner of our eye so that we make like an outline I guess for our halo eye. And I'm kind of just following the line that I made when we used our two colors in the crease. I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Master Conceal in the shade 20 Light with my Ulta eyeshadow brush and I'm just applying that into the center of my lid which is basically just where we didn't put the purple eyeshadow and you can cover some of it if you didn't like where you placed it. But this is just going to make a better base for our glitter eyeshadow that we're going to use for our halo eye. I'm going to be taking the shade Luscious, which is just a champagne glittery eyeshadow with my Real Techniques cre Crease Prep Brush. That's kind of hard to say. <laughs> um, and we're just going to be applying it on top of where we put the concealer. I'm going to be using these false eyelashes and I didn't show you me putting them on because I was up so close to the mirror you couldn't even see it because this is my first time applying eyelashes on myself and I'm just going to be taking my Better Than Sex mascara and applying that over it and I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in the shade Ebony with my Ulta angled eyeliner brush and just doing my eyebrows. I didn't show you in depth because that would take a long time. So if you guys want to see an eyebrow tutorial, just let me know and I'll do one. But I'm just concealing my brow 
And now I'm going to be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Stick Foundation in the shade Warm Ivory and just basically drawing it on my face. And now I'm going to be taking my Real Techniques Expert Face Brush and blending it all in. I'm taking my Ulta Beauty Matte Bronzer with this random angled brush again. <laughs> Another random one because it doesn't have a name on it. And I'm just going to be contouring my face. Also, if you want a tutorial on this, you can tell me and let me know. I just didn't go in depth because it would take a very long time. <laughs> I'm taking my Urban Decay Afterglow Highlighter Palette and using the shade No Angel. Just applying that over where I contoured on my nose and on my cupid's bow. Now I'm going to be taking another random brush. It's just like a big fluffy brush and I'm just going to be blending those in together. I'm taking my Tarte blush in the shade Glisten with my Ulta face powder brush and applying my blush. I'm going to be taking my Tardis Lip Paint in the shade Birthday Suit, which I got for my birthday as a birthday gift from Tarte. And it's just a nude color so that it doesn't distract from the eyes. And this was so... It was, it's, a, it's a nice lip because it's like super buttery and nice and it just feels nice to have it on your lips. Thank you guys so much for watching my eyeshadow tutorial and if you liked it then give me a thumbs up and if you didn't like it give me a thumbs up <laughs> but really I mean bye <laughs>